Hello, everybody. Happy Friday. I recorded earlier, about 32 minutes, couldn't get my video to change the uh, orientation. It was wonky. I messed with it and messed with it, and finally I just deleted it. So I have 32 minutes of work in this this morning. I want to get this done. I want this to be the end of this because I have others I want to get on to. This is my Farmer's Wife journal. It's a, a replication of a magazine from the 1920s. This particular was the cover of December 1921. And this is the spine. It's a three-hole pamphlet stitch. Grungy. Not as grungy as I can get, but this cover was so cool. On the back side was this little child. So I didn't want to lose that image, so I stiffened it up with a cardboard picture frame and made it a flip because I didn't want to cover him. He's so cute. There's about, I don't know, three or four videos up on this already. Here's some old lace. I need to tuck something in there. This is way older. Um, this is Christmas in Iowa. I just might just tuck that in there and not do anything more to it because... It makes a good writing spot. So let's ink this up and just leave it as is. I don't think everything has to be junked up, does it? Like with tags and tickets and numbers and stamping. and I mean, I do like all that, but sometimes I think, depending on who gets the journal, maybe they'd like to do some of that themselves. So... Christmas in Iowa. This was uh, the paper cover, the jacket, to a book that I use quite a bit of stuff out of. So there's that. That's cute. Got a recipe. I'll kind of make this a final flip through. I don't know why I have a paper clip here. A um, couple of stitched ads and things. Corner tuck. Little tuck here, this, this, this is a flip out. Smorgasbord, December 1937. And they're like stories people have submitted, is what they are. This is from another whole different book. There's Holiday Soup, November 1938. Put a ticket on here for a, a tab. This is from. Um, Raleigh's 18, really, 1840, how about 1940? 1940 Good Health Guide Cookbook and Almanac. So that I have quite a few old almanacs, so that's a page from that. Some recipes, a little pocket that I tucked this in. This is a page from uh, that same almanac, May and June of 19, what did I say, 19... I said 1940. Yeah, so there's that. That's interesting. That stuff's fun to read. <sighs> Obviously, this needs work done. I must have just tucked that in. So what are we going to do with this? I made a tab. Oh, this must be the side I want. This is cut. Okay. So I'm going to... Um, do my... Corner a little bit. And then I think the edges. I probably should have put it on cardstock. Let's see. Yeah, that needs to be mounted on something. Maybe just um let's see what we can find in our trusty new favorite book. Sometimes the inside pages are, are good. Let's use this red. There's some good card stock. Oh, that's pretty. That'll be pretty. I'll take it down to the edge. There. Let's 
loud when your chair isn't it sorry about that guys right in your ears um, glue this on and then trim so I had to pick my granddaughter up at school today my daughter-in-law called what are you doing I said nothing I just made some biscuits and um, sausage gravy I said I just took biscuits out of the oven and she said the school had called and my granddaughter needed picked up. I said, I'll go get her. So off I went, got her, her tummy hurt. She ate some of those Takis, hot, I don't even know what they are, chips or whatever they're, whatever they are. She ate some of those last night and she thought that's why her tummy hurt. Well, everybody is throwing up around here and has fevers so I said uh, I made a big deal about those Takis I said you know you shouldn't I hope you didn't eat those Takis and she goes I did last night I said oh you shouldn't eat those you know those are bad they had on the news about those and it's true they're doing things to the linings of kids stomachs or adults even probably there's uh, different levels of heat and apparently there's one that's like firehouse hot and kids are doing these challenges and they're literally, oh, that's not going to work. That's not going to work. They're doing things to the landings of their stomach with them. I'll never eat them again, she says. <laughs> so scared her for life. Damaged my kid, grandkid. So this is not wanting to fit in there. I have to round it myself. So she was here on the couch, fell asleep watching uh, Young Sheldon on, I think it's on Netflix. And I had, I just sat there and I didn't do anything. Stayed quiet, waited for her to wake up. Ran to the dollar store, Dollar General, and got her a Gatorade. And a couple of little crafty things in the Christmas aisle. Gave her my lap desk. She did a, few, a little bit on one of them. And the next thing I knew, she was laying down. I sent a picture to her mom. I said, don't hurry. She's out. No, no need to hurry. She's out. So. That's my morning. Very lazy one. Did I take this out of here? I think I did. It works. Or did I take it out of a pocket? Yeah, it's going to have to go here. It won't show. That'll work. Now we need something for there. What have we got? Another recipe? Should this be recipes? Um, where's that book? Some of them are are already. Oh, fudge! Christmas fruit cake. Ush. They did fruit cakes on the British Bake Off. Oh, that's cute little. Pinoche, Pinochi? Is that what it's called? Pinochi? Pinoche. I don't know what it is. <sighs> Adding my fake accent. Chocolate mousse. I need a small one. Um. Oh. You know what? That's a cute picture. Who likes peanut brittle? I think I just saw peanut brittle. Oh, butterscotch. That's a long ways from peanut brittle. I was thinking yesterday about my mom always made, always made, um, what do you call that? Divinity. And she would make colored. Oh, there's a cute. Oh, that's cute. 
Christmas tree. Oh, that's a whole story. Um, I've never made it. I was thinking I should try that. Divinity. So, okay. All I need is something for this little pocket. Um, 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 um. It could be folded. It could be candied popcorn, couldn't it? And I could put it on the back. Yes. Now I'll glue it. Concentrating. Concentration. Let's see. Let's glue this. Boy, did I ever cut crooked. We'll fix that. <sighs> Got a couple more Christmas gifts yesterday. Um... Grabbed a couple gift cards to Amazon for backup plan. And now I'm trying to plan uh, for a naughty Santa. And I'll have, I have a whole bunch of things that I've bought throughout the year. And I stick them in a drawer or a closet that is my like gift closet. And I don't know who to give them to. They're just like, when I see a sale, on bath towels or something, I'll just grab a couple sets, stick them in, or even just one set, or just a towel and a couple washcloths. I've got a bunch of that kind of stuff, and yeah, that'll fit. And um, so I'm thinking I got to get some guy things. There's tons of girl stuff. Um, Nothing for the guys, so I need to go get some clever, clever guy things, whatever that would be. It's hard. My boys have everything. Not that they have everything, but there's not a tool I could need to get them. Um, if I threw in a flannel, I could do that, actually. Throw in a flannel. I have three sons, and they're all different, different sizes. They're all, one's, tall, one's real tall. Two of them are tall, really tall. So, that would be tricky. Let's see, where are we? This flips, no, this doesn't flip out. I just didn't want to lose the turkey legs. It's a little recipe. Oh, this? Oh, yeah. And we've got a cake and stuff like that. Lots of journaling spaces. I did some photos on the sewing machine one day. Isn't that cool? Stitched around them. There's another pocket right there I could put. Um, besides a recipe, I need some photo stuff. Here's a picture. This is cute. The night before Christmas. That's kind of cute. Put that... I need a pocket. I need a belly band. That's what I need. Let's see. How about a red one? Let's do a red belly band. About here. 
see. So we've decided we are doing our Christmas get together, me and my my uh, children, four kids, two, let's see, I have four kids, I have, oh, there's, they all have, let's see, I have a daughter-in-law, I have two daughter-in-laws, two daughter-in-laws, three sons, and a daughter, and a son-in-law, and seven little kids, so, um, Christmas morning, of course, is reserved for Santa. And um, my daughter's husband's sister, they're coming back from uh, Fort Worth, so her Christmas at 2 o'clock is taken, Christmas Day. They have to work around the traveling family, which, of course, you have to accommodate. It's hard. you got to accommodate everybody from out of town. I think it's every year. We play the game every year. What's going to work? What works for you? That won't work. I have to be here. It's just like, I'm like, we'll just, we'll take a back seat and we'll just wait. And when it's right, it's right. And it, I said, okay, how about you guys? How about round two? <laughs> My daughter, she private messaged me. I said, how about round two Christmas day? And she thought I meant a round two. <laughs> I said, no, five o'clock is a good time, but round two, like, you know, like round one is Santa. And by then everything's worn out and they've already, they're already bored with it. So how about five o'clock? We'll do round two, <laughs> round two. So that's what we're doing. Last year I did a Dixie solo cup thing. And the one grandson won all the $5 bills and the dollar bills. It just every time he got a Dixie cup that had money in it and he couldn't, he couldn't see it. He had no clue. I'm going to put a, some kind of a, I don't want to make this loose. I better wait. Some kind of a trim on this and make it cuter. Does anybody else like biscuits and gravy? I browned some sausage and made it into gravy and I made homemade biscuits. Um, and that's that was our lunch. I just thought, oh, that sounds so good. And we have enough for supper. I don't have to cook. All we have to do is heat it up. There. The night before Christmas. And it's torn. I gotta make some of that tape. I've never done it. That tape that looks old. I'll do that. Um to this. There. There we go. That was starting to stick wrong. Okay, there's that. Need to decorate that. Let's see. This book has a lot of different Christmas trims up the sides of the pages. Like this. But I don't want to lose this picture. That's what I run into. Like, I love this butt. I love this butt. Um, this is cute. Let's do this. That is, oh no, that won't work. That's going the wrong way. What am I thinking? Well, you know what? It is going to go the wrong way. On a different page. I wanted some ice cream today, and I knew I had ice cream in the deep freeze not in the kitchen in my refrigerator. So before I went down and dug through the freezer to bring it in, because once I go get it, I don't want to go back down and take it to the freezer. So I pulled a bunch of stuff out of my freezer in the house. 
in the house, in the kitchen. And um, I don't know. I just wanted ice cream, even though it's cold. It's raining right now. But even though it was cold, see, that's kind of cute. I could do that up at the side of a page. It's got to be on this side over here, though. Actually, would that work like that? Kind of would. I feel like this needs to be stiffer. So let's go back to that belly band that I just put in and decorate it. Oh, that's a Coke ad. See, if I take this out, I take out the Coke ad. I think I can do it though. If you watch the John Wick 4 series, there's a John Wick 5. You can watch the trailer already on YouTube. I watched what they, well, what they'll tell you. It's like a big tease. It's coming out in 2024. How about that? And I could also, should I glue it down or make it another tuck? Um... How about that? Make it another tuck? Yes, let's. So I'm excited about that. And then I found on uh, Peacock a, a little mini series called Continental, which is the Hotel John Wick. It's like, it's weird. I don't even know how to explain it if you don't watch it. It's like you can go there and you can't shoot or kill in the Continental, but it's where all the killers check in, get their like commissions or whatever, their um, orders come up, you know, like hits on people. There's a series on, on, um, spit it out. I just put that glue on the wrong doggone side. What am I thinking? And I don't have my baby wipes over here. Um, so I don't know if it was made, or it had to be have made, been made after the John Wick series, but uh, it's called the Continental, and it's good. It's good. It's good. It's very good. I meant for this to be here. we go so I could stick something in there we'll stick this in there this very wholesome cute picture this is um, some kind of packaging but it'll work it'll work out. I'm trying to use up my art glitter glue. I'm never going to buy it again. I don't like it. I loved it when I got it. And I loved that little, once you lose your needle and I don't like the replacement things that I got for it. I just don't like them. I, 
hate it. So there's that. I think I'll barely let a little bit of that brown show through. There. Decorated my sister's house yesterday um, for her. And it turned out really cute. She's not a decorator. She has a lot of very neat things though, but I brought in her little tree. It's just a pencil tree and my son put all the lights on for her and put it back in the corner by her couch in her chair. And uh, he did a good job on the lights. It's got white lights on it, but he says, I think it needs more. Well, all she had was a string of red, a string of blue. And I'm like, no, you don't want a red, white, and blue tree. That's just, no. So he put the red on and just kind of worked it up through. And it's just really cute. And then... Um, I brought in a bunch of her greenery. She collects those big, huge, rusty bells. That looks terrible. Um, so I put a, I put a, on her TV stand, well, her TV's on the wall, but below it, she's got a, well, it's actually, it's like a library table that I put there when I rearranged her furniture. Um, I put a, like a wicker, not a wicker, you know, like an apple basket, a basket. I put that on it, tilted it tilted it, put greenery all the way through it and on the way out, up and around, and I stuck it. I hate gnomes. Stuck one of, she loves them. She loves gnomes. Put one of her gnomes on the outside and one kind of in the greenery and <sighs> did a whole bunch of things. Hung a sign that said Candy Cane Lane and she has a lot of neat things. She has a set of three iron trees that are, you can see the weld spots on them. They are so cool. I don't know where she got them. She might have got them off like LTV or something. She likes that catalog. Um, that's about... This is not, there's really nothing to that. Um, there we go. Back to back file folders. I love file folders. Okay. Look at this one had. This was my crafty cat all in one Santa. Just stuck tucked in here. I take a folder with me to the library. If I don't have one, they give me one. I have the best library, ladies. Oh, you paid all this money for these copies. You need a folder. Don't you need a folder? Oh, I'll be all right. No, you paid too much money for all I've spent, well, my friend spent as much as $49 making copies there. Um, but I don't know how many times I have to say how fabulous their printer is. But anyway, um, and we don't, you know, she's not using them all in one book. It's like lots. One journal. She, uh, Anyway, I have a lot of file folders. She made a folio for her family members for Christmas and tucked money in, in each one for each person with a note in it. She had it all typed out on the computer and printed. Told her that they had to go buy a sweatshirt to wear to Christmas. She didn't care what kind. Just go buy yourself a new sweatshirt. And I don't, I don't know the dollar amount or anything. It didn't matter. But I said, what a neat idea. They could get a Christmas sweatshirt. They could get a, you know, a Carhartt, add money to it if they wanted or Under Armour or whatever their thing is. You know, one with a deer on the front if they're big in the, if they're a guy that likes hunting. I have, you know, grandkids that would want like 49ers or Under Armour. I just thought it was a cute idea. Such a cute idea. Almost better than Christmas pajamas because, you know, then you got a sweatshirt to wear to school or, you know, just out around, out, out and about. 
But her folios, anyway, back to her and her folios. She's just learning. She bought uh, Amy Crafty Cat's kit. I don't remember which one. I think all in one sand of it. She She's made folios with that one and a few others that she bought. And they turned out so cute. How about that? Let's do that. Is that straight? Well, doesn't matter. Um, anyway, she's doing really good. Really, really. Uh, she's got an addiction problem now. Let's just put it that way. It's good it's not something more harmful to your health. She is loving the junk journal world. I'm just going to do this. In case any glue seeps out. Hopefully that takes. And I'll have to come back to that pocket. That's cute. That's a cute pocket. Okay. Where are we at? I think we're winding down. So I went in and stuck a bunch of these things in and then didn't finish. Now that's cute with that uh, red. A little bit of red peeking out. What a nice rain. It's too warm to turn to ice. And I don't have to go anywhere, so I don't care. If it does get icy. As long as my kids are home safe. There we go. Nope, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to just glue this on. And I think this will be my last piece for this video because I want to try to see if my problem is um, a storage thing. I don't have hardly anything in my phone anymore. I have moved everything to my SD card. I don't know. Oh my gosh, my neighbors are here. I'm so happy. I haven't seen them in ages. I told you I've lived in a lake. I live in a lake community, and everybody of the 57 people in this little community, most of them leave. There's a few that live here year round. I live here year round because I, you know, I'm not keeping two places at my age. And I love my little place. So it's everything I could need. But they, you know, they have jobs still in there where they're at. And I'm just, I'm retired, so I don't do any of that. Okay, this is going to be it for today. And I'll be back to finish up this book next round. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend.